I'm John. Here's my report. Well, the Seattle Center Coliseum will now be known as the Key Arena due to a major sponsorship money provided by Key Bank. Key Bank narrowly edged out bidding rival Chef Boyardee, who would have changed the name of the Coliseum to the Chef Boyardee Beef Arena. <laughs> A new legal drug is hitting Seattle called Herbal Ecstasy, a mixture of green tea extract and herbs that promises hours of happiness. Now, the main benefit of the drug is that store clerks in Wallingford will probably seem a little more eager to help you than they were before. <laughs> An Olympia measure would revise the wording of marriage license to include the sentence, neither, <laughs> neither you nor your spouse is the property of each other. This replaces the current wording, don't sell your spouse to motorcycle people. <laughs> Earlier this evening, Dweezil Zappa hosted a Como TV special about pop culture in the 90s called Hype. Immediately following that, Como's Cindy Reinhart hosted a special retrospective of her career called Hyper. <laughs> a, new, a new Ralph Lauren sheet pattern has been named Tacoma Cream. Do we, do we need a punchline for this one here? Move ahead. All right. Thank you, yes. The Seattle Times has filed a lawsuit accusing the University of Washington of illegal secrecy in their search for a new president. The university has responded by canceling their subscription. <laughs> a, rot a Rottweiler dog in Roy was rescued from a branch 40 feet up in a tree last Tuesday. Coincidentally, firemen also rescued a male man who was found 60 feet up in the same tree. <laughs> Finally, the state's proposed budget has been placed online on the internet, allowing users to provide their own input on suggested expenditures. So far, the most common input has been, I'm typing this while completely naked. <laughs> this has been the John Report. Thank you.